This is a production of the National Gas Company of Trinidad and Tobago Limited at the forefront of sustainable energy. We understand the importance of a clean environment. Sustainability is, is not just a, um, a luxury now, it's, it's, it's really compulsory for us. Even though we are a sporting facility, we see a real importance for us to be actively involved in the pursuit of decreasing our uh, energy footprint. They say the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. All steps are important, even the small ones. And so the more steps you take, we can also encourage others to do the same. When you consider that 80% of the planet is, is covered in water, and I think it really makes sense to get everyone competent in the water. Flying Fish is one of the very first competitive swim club. Um, we're proud of our uh, over 50 years of existence, of really being a catalyst for aquatic, the aquatic fraternity. We want to lead by example. And so we would also like for not just our practices, but the physical facility itself to be an example of decreasing your energy consumption and things like that and becoming a more sustainable facility. We have um, secured small steps already towards becoming a more sustainable and energy efficient facility. Well, historically, we used a lot of the lights that would typically be used the metal halide and the tungsten bulbs. But as you know, there are a lot of more energy efficient options now, like the LED lights. And so through some of these strategic partnerships that Flyfish has made, we were able to uh, identify a lot of different areas. We source in a variable speed pump um, that would allow us to be more inefficient during peak and low periods. We already have some solar uh, powered lights that are in use. Um, but there's a proposal um, for 18 energy solar panels to be installed in a more robust installation to affect the overall facility. The more savings that we could have related to, to energy is the more money that we could put into the actual sport and things that matter. So we see a direct benefit for it. All of those efforts would only um, extend our ability to keep enjoying the planet. Well, for a long time, we have had designated um, containers for the different types of trash, for plastics and so forth. And we feel that's a bit of an educational process for the kids who are now being mandated to put the different types of trash in different types of containers and so forth. So after the, the trash is separated, they send to the respective facilities uh, for proper recycling. Another step has been us planting trees in, on the properties adjacent to our facility. In fact, it's actually some moringa trees that serve more benefits than just, um, you know, producing oxygen and things like that. And so hopefully if we're doing the right things and moving in the right direction, we can also encourage others to do the same. We encourage people to take steps because they say success breeds success. The work we do today impacts tomorrow because it's aimed at salvaging the, the, the precious resources we have on the planet. And so we see it as, as very vital and necessary towards the, the safe well-being of humanity at large. They say the journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. All steps are important, even the small ones, uh, because they bring you further uh, towards your goal. And so we encourage people to take steps because they say success breeds success. And so the more steps you take is, is the more that you make possible. And so hopefully if we're doing the right things and moving in the right direction, we can also encourage others to do the same. This is a production of the National Gas Company of Trinidad and Tobago Limited at the forefront of sustainable energy.